Fishing Boats and Boat Shed Seattle. I'm Dave Carlson, the listing agent for this 1976 74 foot Monk McQueen motor yacht. We are really excited to be able to bring you this listing. Uh, she is 74 feet of splendor, quality builder, Northwest well-known designer Ed Monk, built of the finest material of the day, uh, 1960s through the 1970s, by the McQueen Boatyard in Vancouver, BC. We've entered the uh, aft deck via two, uh, either one of the uh, side entries on the side decks into this very nice uh, upper salon. Moving forward uh, here soon, well, excuse me, uh, here we are with a uh, wet bar in the aft end of the salon. Water, a sink, and an ice maker. Now we're moving forward. Uh, you see the side doors uh, out to uh, the side decks and the uh, entry or exit uh, from the vessel. And we're into this uh, beautiful pilot house. This vessel is built of uh, a cedar for the hull from the water line uh, up. Uh, below the water line is reported to be mahogany, inch and a quarter. And Alaska yellow cedar is used throughout for the, uh, uh, the deck beams and, and other framing materials. She's been, uh, the bottom has been refastened in 1999, uh, I believe by the Phil Brooks yard, who has uh, done a lot of the early maintenance for this vessel. Those of you that are familiar with Phil Brooks know the quality of uh, long-standing, high-quality work from that yard. Plenty of storage in this uh, dining salon. Uh, you see those cabinets port and starboard. The galley features a uh, full-size uh, refrigerator and freezer, a trash compactor, a, a dishwasher, a double sink, and a microwave. These cabinets are duplicated port and starboard in this uh, dining salon. Now we're moving into the forward cabin. Uh, this uh, particular head does not have a shower. This is uh, two singles in this forward cabin. Very good, nice size single berth though. Now we've uh, turned around stern and exit back up into the dining salon galley. And you'll see the passageway, companionway, uh, into the master cabin. Now this is a California king a bed. Very nice master suite. In suite head with uh, bathtub and shower enclosure. All this interior woodwork and all the surfaces are, are absolutely exquisite. The 8V71 uh, uh, Detroit's uh, naturally aspirated uh, cruise at uh, 10 knots and uh, reported uh, uh, top speed is 16. Uh, at 10 knots you're burning uh, uh, 10 gallons an hour. Now, the entrance to the engine room is the aft end of the owner's stateroom.
you'll find this stand up walk around engine room with uh, a very complete uh, shop space will be a delight to work in it's well lighted well ventilated uh, easy access to all of the batteries it also houses the uh, the generator This boat has just come out of the uh, yard in Port Angeles. Um, I believe that was, yes, it was platypus. And it has a current bottom paint. The uh, top side paint was touched up. And we've just uh, completed uh, revarnishing the, uh, the exterior varnish. You'll find the boat looks very well. Here we are in the aft cabin, which is uh, entered uh, either from the main salon or from the engine room. And we have a, uh, a double there and a very large single. This head also has an enclosed shower. The owner's reason for sale is they uh, took a job, uh, uh, a move to uh, the East Coast, and um, it interrupted their plans for uh, their ownership of this vessel. So it is available for you. We invite you to go to waterlineboats.com or boatshedseattle.com for uh, um, 150 photographs. It will include uh, detailed photos of the flybridge. And you can uh, either call Dave Carlson, the listing agent, or send me an email. I'll be happy to give you a private showing. Thanks for viewing, and see you on the dock.